catch up to me. I'm fast, brother. <laughs> How are you guys? You good? Highlights. I think probably that means, you know, some of the bigger titles in the festival. We have the two George Clooney films, so we have The Ides of March, which George Clooney directed, and also The Descendants, directed by Alexander Payne, but starring George Clooney. This year we have films from 55 different countries, and I think it's very diverse. We have, you know, Chinese films in the festival, and also interesting that we have two um, ethnically Tibetan films in the festival, which I think is a new development in, in Chinese filmmaking. The Sunbeaten Path is, well, it's a Tibetan road movie, uh, the first such. It follows the Western genre of road movie, but it gives it a very distinctive, very different spin. Nobody in the West has made a road movie like this. If you look at the two Tibetan films that I have in the program, they have absolutely no political content. They, they talk only about family issues. Uh, in, the, in one case, uh, about the relationship between a father, his son, and the son's wife. In the other case, about the son who has accidentally killed his mother. What they want to do, I think, is make films about ordinary people in more or less ordinary situations that are true to their own experience as Tibetans. Well, to have five Chinese films this year is, is quite a lot, actually. Chinese cinema now is a great model for the region. It shows what can be done both at the top, at the big budget end of the spectrum, and at the bottom, which is the you know the low budget or no budget end of the spectrum. We really enjoyed working in Shanghai because it just felt like a really exciting adventure to be there. It felt like it was a city that was changing very quickly. So it would be nice to make a story that was, um, but not just based in China, was connected to the rest of the world. I would love to work in China. I think it would be fun. Mainland, Hong Kong, anywhere. I'd love it. <laughs>